Karen could sit there. Thank you. Sorry. It's hell for the pants are all up. I'm just telling you. Treasurer, 
Olivia Mayer, historian. Allison Garst, vice president, Tower of One. Jacob Misaki, Stuka representative. Thank you, officers. You may now be seated. I would now like to welcome Allie to present certificates to our Power of One Step One completers. Power of One is a national program which helps members to find and use their personal power. Members set their own goals, work to achieve them, and enjoy the results. The skills members learn in Power of One help them now and in the future with school, friends, and family, and on the job. The following members from our chapter com completed the first unit of the Power of One national program this year. Eliza Barton, Sophia Castillo, Alexis Ford, Zach Green, Cadence Glenn, Sienna Jones, Calvin Majette, Taryn Mikey, Casey Mezzik. Ava Meinhardt, Carly Mesicki, Hannah Sievers, Bailey Carmen, and Abby Wolling. Next, Olivia will recognize our members in higher office positions at district and state levels. multiple members exert their leadership skills through higher levels this past year. Two of our members were district officers for the 2020-2021 school year. Kaylin Conrad was district vice president of public relations and Annie Wright was our district vice president of star events. Heading into next school year, we will continue to have two district officers from our chapter. Abby Wallene was elected 2021-2022 district D president while Annie Wright will continue holding her position as district vice president of star events. We're also very excited to have a state officer from our chapter this next school year. Kaylin Conrad was elected the state's vice president of public relations for the 2021-2022 school year. Kaylin is one of eight FCCLA members in Kansas elected into state office. She is the only second state officer in school history, the other one being Lizzie Erickson in 2018. Our last higher office held by members of our chapter is our peer education team. Kara Hoffenstein, Sydney Holthouse, and Jacob Mesky were peer education members during the 2020-2021 school year and will continue to hold their offices next school year. Our chapter is very proud of these members for taking their leadership skills to the next level. They have represented our chapter well and will continue to do so this upcoming school year. Moving forward, we will now recognize our star event participants from this school year. We had 26 participants in districts and 20 members compete at the state level. When I call your name, please come get your certificate. Annie Wright and Olivia Mayer, National Programs in Action, District Silver, State Gold. <laughs> Quentin Willier, Career Investigation, Districts Silver. Casey Misaki, Carly Misaki, and Taryn Mikey, Chapter and Review Portfolio, Districts Gold. <laughs> Sarah Van Story, Repurpose and Redesign, District Silver, State Silver. <laughs> Kara Hoffenstein, Sydney Holthouse, and Ava Meinhart, Chapter Service Project Display, Districts Gold, State Silver. Shaley Heidemann and Paxton Meyer, Food Innovations, Districts Gold, State, Silver. <laughs> Bella Wade, Madison Hovenstein, and Kendall Mikey, Chapter and Review Display, Districts Bronze, State, Silver. <laughs> Hannah Sievers and Bailey Tharman, Chapter and Review Display, Districts Bronze. Kaylin Conrad, Allison Garce, and Lauren Shutter, Chapter and Review Portfolio, Districts Gold, State Gold. <laughs> Lance and Perry.
Perry, Maverick Hoffenstein, and Jacob Misaki, professional presentation, District Silver. <laughs> Alexis Ford, Sophia Castillo, and Abby Walleen, Chapter Service Project Portfolio, District Silver, State Silver. <laughs> Congratulations to all of our STAR events participants. We appreciate your hard work this year and are proud of you for continuing the traditions of our chapter. And you can find most of these STAR events over there. Next, we'd like to recognize our 2020 to 2021 Knowledge Bowl team. Our team competed in virtual competitions this year that challenged their knowledge in six different areas. Personal finance, consumer rights, technology, health and safety, environment, and FCCLA knowledge. Our team members this past year were Kara Hoffenstein, Captain, Annie Wright, Olivia Mayer, Madison Hoffenstein, and Quentin Willier. Thank you to these members for putting in extra time for competitions, and we hope you can get back to competing in at in-person contests next year. members from our chapter. First we have Madison Wurzberger. Maddie has been a member at FCCLA for, for all four years of high school. Her favorite memory is when Mrs. Reddick made her, Riley, and Reagan do a star event together and they were the only group from our chapter to not qualify for the state competition. <laughs> After high school, Maddie plans to major in nursing at Fort Hayes State University. <laughs> Next we have Reagan Bott. Reagan has been a chapter member for two years of high school. Her favorite memory is designing different t-shirts for our chapter each year, and after high school, Reagan will be attending Fort Hayes State University to major in graphic design. <laughs> Lastly, we have Riley Jones. Riley has also been a member of our chapter for two years now. Her favorite memory was going to the elementary school for her star event her junior year. After Riley graduates, she plans, plans to attend Cloud County Community College to play softball and major in social science. Thank you, seniors, for being a part of our chapter over the past few years. We wish you the best of luck in your future. Now we would like to present the FCS Academic Awards. This award is to members who received a 90% or above in their FCS classes this school year. Once your name is read, please come accept your award. Eliza Barton. Alexis Ford, Kaden Flynn, Deanna Jones, Karen Mikey, Casey Mezuki, Carly Mezuki, Hannah Seavers, Bailey Tharman, Abby Walling, Allison Garst, Maverick Hoffenstein, Shaley Heideman, Olivia Mayer, Jacob Mezicki, Paxton Meyer, Lance and Perry, Jaslyn Posh, Isabella Wade, Quentin Willier, Annie Wright, Kaylin Conrad, Kara Hoffenstein, Madison Hoffenstein, Cindy Holthouse, Kendall Mikey, Maddie Shirley, Lauren Shutter, Sarah Van Story, Reagan Five. Riley Jones, Madison Orsberger. Thank you everyone for your hard work in class this school year.
Our chapter does multiple fundraisers throughout the year to help us raise money for upcoming conferences and trips. Some of our key fundraisers for this school year include Krispy Kreme Donuts, Cookie Dough, and Breakfast Burrito Sales. All of our members worked hard to fundraise their share, but only two could have the top sales of the year. Our member with the second highest amount of sales from the 2020-2021 school year is Sydney Holthouse. Our member with the top sales from the 2020-2021 school year is Madison Hoffenstein. Congratulations and thank you for helping raise money for our chapter. recognize our most active chapter members. These members have participated in the most activities this school year and have earned the most points based off of our point system. The, the freshman most active member is Abby Walling with 195 points. The sophomore most active member is Annie Wright with 245 points. Your most active member is Kara Hoffenstein with 270 points. The senior most active member is Madison Horsberger with 70 points. And lastly, the 2020-2021 most active chapter member is Kara Hoffenstein. Thank you all for going the extra mile with your participation this year. Moving along, we would now like to present chapter member awards. The first award was chosen by Ms. Reddick. This award is given to two members who have exemplified exceptional leadership this school year. The two members who will receive this leadership award are Kara Hoffenstein and Kaylin Conrad. The next two awards were voted on by all members of our chapter. First, we have the Extra Mile Award. This award is given to one underclassman and one upperclassman who have dedicated to our chapter and are willing to help others succeed. The upperclassman receiving this award is Kara Hoffenstein. The underclassman receiving this award is Annie Wright. Next, we have the Kindness Award. This award is given to one underclassman and one upperclassman who have led others with kindness throughout the year. The upperclassman receiving this award is Madison Hoffenstein. And the underclassman receiving this award is Allie Garst. <laughs> Along with our chapter awards, we would also like to announce our state awards. Rush Week Award, First Place, Grand Prize, Community Service Award, Bronze, Membership Award, Bronze, Spotlight Chapter, Second Place, High Honors, District D, Chapter Member of the Year Award, to Kara. <laughs> present our honorary member award. Since we didn't have a banquet last year, we would also like to recognize our most honorary member from last year, which was Mrs. Hutley. So, we have... Project Portfolio Star Event. 
Alexis Ford, Community Service Project Portfolio Star Event. Sophia Castillo, Community Service Project Portfolio Star Event. Ali Garst, Chapter Review Portfolio Star Event. Lauren Shutter, Chapter Review Portfolio Star Event. Paxton Meyer, Food Innovation Star Event. Shaley Heidemann, Food Innovation Star Event. Madison Hoffenstein, Chapter Interview Dis Display Star Event. Kendall Mikey, Chapter Interview Display Star Event. And Bella Wade, Chapter Interview Display Star Event. Congratulations to these members for their hard work. <laughs> Moving along, we will now install our 2021 to 2022 officers. This candle symbolizes our first purpose, to provide opportunities for personal development and preparation for adult life. symbolizes our third purpose, to encourage democracy through cooperative action in the home and community. represents our fifth purpose, to promote a greater understanding between teen, youth, and adults.
Paxton Meyer and Madison Hobbenstein please come up here at this time. We will now hand off our roses to the new officers taking our positions and find our seats at the table. focus our attention on leadership. Good leaders are special people. They view the situation, recognize the need, and encourage the necessary action. They understand the importance of teamwork and cooperation and the fulfillment of responsibilities. Each year symbolizes one more step in the process of individual growth. The installation of newly elected officers is both a joyful and solemn occasion. We congratulate them and look forward to their new vision. The following officers have been elected to serve this chapter for the coming year. Jacob Misaki, Stuco Representative. Olivia Mayer, Secretary. Allison Garst, Vice President of Public Relations. Kara Hoffenstein, President. Kaylin Conrad, Vice President. Sydney Holthouse, Treasurer. Paxton Meyer, Historian. Annie Wright, Vice President of Star Events. And Madison Hoffenstein, Vice President of Community Service. officers, the highest honors of the organization are being bestowed on you. Our chapter has faith and confidence in your ability to lead the organization forward. The pledge of your office signifies your willingness to do this. Please repeat after me. I will, to the best of my ability, I will, to the best of my ability, faithfully perform all the duties, faithfully perform all of the duties, of the office to which I have been elected, of the office to which I have been elected. You have heard the pledge your officers have made. It is important that you support them in the performance of their duties. You may now be seated. As outgoing officers, we ask you to remember that real leadership strength comes through cooperative efforts. We are confident the organization will continue to grow under the leadership of these new officers provided. And now we will give to Kaylin for a thank you message. Thank you everyone for coming tonight and for all the support our chapter has received this school year. We definitely could not have done many things without the consistent help from friends, family, and our community as a whole. We appreciate all of the donations from businesses, support through our fundraisers, and how much everyone has assisted us with what we have done this year. And now Cindy will draw door prizes. Okay, one second. So if I call your name, just will come up. <laughs> Bill Van Story.
Okay, back to Kara. <laughs> Now it is time for our closing ceremony. Members, please rise. FCCLA members, we are challenged to accept the responsibility of making decisions that affect our lives today and the world tomorrow. Let us repeat our creed. We are the family, career, and community leaders of America. We face the future with warm courage and high hope, for we have the clear consciousness of seeking old and precious values, for we are the builders of homes, Homes for America's future. Homes where living will be the expression of everything that is good and fair. Homes where truth and love and security and faith will be realities, not dreams. We are the family, career, and community leaders of America. We face the future with warm courage and high hopes. The 73rd Annual Award Celebration of the Wabunsee High School FCCLA Chapter is now adjourned. Thank you everyone for coming and please have a safe drive home.